Who here doesn't love delicious mouth-watering salsa? Freshly made salsa contains a powerhouse of nutritional compounds that can heal the body. The ingredients in salsa may help reduce the risk of chronic diseases such as heart disease, diabetes, and possibly cancer. Most people don't know this, but salsa is an excellent option to help with weight management. That's because it's a low-calorie, keto-friendly condiment that can help you feel satiated much longer. Plus, it's a great justification to down a margarita the size of your face. Just kidding! Now let's go through the seven ingredients needed to make salsa and the health benefits for each. Number one, tomatoes. These are a great source of vitamin C, potassium, and antioxidants like lycopene. Number two, onions. These contain antioxidants and sulfur compounds that can help lower blood sugar levels, reduce inflammation, and improve heart health. Also, if you don't want to cry while cutting onions, try freezing them for about 25 minutes before you cut into them. Number three, jalapeno. Chili peppers like jalapeno or serrano contain capsaicin, and this can help boost metabolism, reduce inflammation, and improve digestive health. You probably know this, but capsaicin is sometimes found in OTC muscle rubs. Number four, cilantro, my favorite. This is rich in antioxidants and has been shown to have antimicrobial properties. For me, the more the merrier. Cilantro is also thought to help reduce cholesterol and blood pressure levels. Number five, garlic. This has been shown to have dozens of potential health benefits, including reducing blood pressure, improving cholesterol ratios, and boosting immune function. Plus, I hear it keeps the vampires away. Compounds in garlic help get rid of H. pylori, thought to cause ulcers, and also methane-dominant SIBO. Number six, lime juice. Lime juice is good so long as you don't get it in your eye. It contains a lot of vitamin C and antioxidants, which can help boost immune function and reduce inflammation. Coming in at number seven is salt. I bet you're surprised because too much salt can be harmful and raise your blood pressure, but moderate normal amounts of salt is important for regulating fluid balance, healthy muscle function, nerve health, and even proper blood pressure levels. But too much is a huge problem. So whether you're using it as a dip for veggies or a topping for grilled chicken or fish or tacos or adding it to salads and soups, this Mexican favorite is a versatile and delicious condiment that clearly provides important health benefits. So eat up, there you have it, the seven reasons to eat more salsa. Some of you watching this might enjoy reading my recipes for diabetes. They're easy, they're delicious, and they're dairy and gluten free. For that reason, I put a link in the description in case this topic interests you. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm Susie Cohen. I'm a real life pharmacist, so I know a lot about medications and metabolic pathways. I've been writing medical articles for 30 years. You may have seen me in your local newspaper or some popular morning shows. If you're interested on my advice regarding a specific health topic, I invite you to use the search box at my website, suzycohen.com. I've used my knowledge of pharmaceuticals and herbs to formulate custom dietary supplements and skincare formulas that actually work. Please check the description below for links to my blog and my vitamin shop. Also, hit that subscribe button if you'd like to watch more content like this. Don't forget to ring the notification bell too.